I'm at the Royal Agricultural Winter Fair, and Melanie is going to be my personal guide. Tell me what you got here. Hi, I'm Bee Girl, and Marcus, welcome to the 90th Annual Royal Agricultural Winter Fair, and we are here at the Toronto Beekeepers booth. We have an entire array of products from the hive, and a number of the products that we're presenting here are from members of the Toronto Beekeepers group. I'm with the Toronto Beekeepers Cooperative, as is my trusty uh, salesperson here, Kathy Cosma. Kathy says hi. Yeah, we're with the Toronto Beekeepers Co-op and we're Urban Beekeepers and here some of the products from the hive. One of the most popular items at the show, thanks to Dr. Oz, who last week said this is a vital food for anyone deficient in vitamin B. Bee wow. pollen, that's what it is. Have sales uh, increased since he said that here? Well, I can't really say. I mean, people that are in the know know that bee pollen is very good for you. For collecting bee pollen is quite unique in that every little bit of pollen is collected by the bees on their furry little legs. And as they go back to the hive, we harvest the pollen from the hive. And thus, okay. here we go. It's a very slow process, but indeed, it's well worth the work. Okay. And these are from your members? Yes. Are they based in Ontario or yep. Canada? Where? Absolutely. Dutchman's Gold is here in Ontario. Very proud. that we have here in Ontario. All Delivery, in Ontario. We believe in a 100% pure Ontario product. Okay. So here we have a very cute way of dispensing the honey. It's in a little bear. It's the same wildfire that you would find in a jar, but it's very handy. A lot of people, when it comes to honey, you have to think of honey somewhat like wine. It's got very different uh, uh, nuances, flavors, and because you like honey in your tea. But if you love honey on your toast, this honey might be another great option. This is raw honey. All of our products are raw because they're not brought up to a certain temperature to melt them at. And here, this is where the beekeeping producer got creative. Some wonderful flavors. We've got honey with cocoa, little chocolate and honey. Honey and cinnamon is a fabulous product. And have honey raspberry and it also spreads very well again on toast nicely we have creamed honey this raw honey here spreads very well as opposed to some of the more liquid honeys you see the variation in color the color grade now we're speaking about color grade let's talk about winning at the Royal Winter Fair these beekeepers have entered their honey so over here we are looking at comb honey this is cut directly from the honey frame. Very enjoyable treat. Looks wonderful on a cheese plate. Now what about, just interject, what about the nutritional value of the different flavors and nuances that you find in these different blends here? Well, there, I mean, the, products? More, the greater the purity is going to be greater. I mean, if you're mixing chocolate with your honey, it's going to have a different nutritional value. But what about these other the ones that are just pure, pure honey? One of the things um, what's same here? nutritional value or does it vary? What's very, very important when you're buying honey anywhere, look at the back and you'll see a standard nutritional label that will outline exactly how many calories and the nutritional components of the honey. Always 100%. Look for number one, 100% honey, number two, unpasteurized, and number three, correct labeling. Okay, great. Let's continue That's a now. Guideline. Another, we go. Uh, another product products from the members. Another product from the members from the hive is propolis. Okay. Propolis is an antibacterial product. This is a bee propolis here, a lovely. This one retails for $45, but it's pure. It's a tincture that's made from the propolis from the hive. Okay. Some lovely creams that have uh, come from the hive as well, mixed with other products to make it more uh, efficient on the skin. Oh, and here's something that the kids just absolutely love. That's it. In one life. So look at how many bees it would take to make this. One? How many bees on this? I know. Give a me lot of busy bees. Very busy. You need a colony for them. So back to this. So there are kids are going crazy for that. They're 25 cents each. And another wonderful product. Lip 
refreshing this time of the year is lip balm. Now, why in a lip balm? Tell me. Honey uh, and, and beeswax have medicinal apiotherapy qualities. And um, so mixed with uh, other flavors such as um, orange and uh, we even have a coconut lip balm as well. It's a great product. Okay. Again, moving over here. Instead of petroleum based. You would not have a, a petroleum based candle. Instead of that, we have natural, which is beeswax. Much better because if you have a petroleum based or you don't know what people are putting in the candles at the manufacturing plants, you want to look for the 100% pure label. Again, very, very important. And they come in cute little uh, looks here. We've got some candles here, very small. We even have the tea lights. And one thing that's also being sold is strictly a uh, beeswax bar. You might want to use this for different purposes. I've spoken with artists who like to use beeswax much larger than this on their canvases. Maybe you want to beeswax some leather that you have. Um, other other properties, chafing, who knows? Okay. And over here, so we've got from the smaller packaging to the larger packaging. Okay. And you can buy a milk here at the Royal Winter Fair. Wildflower and summer blossom. Okay. So essentially when you look at the color grades moving from lighter to darker, that's reflective of where the bees are foraging. So in general, you're going to have a lighter honey in the spring moving off to the fall when you've got golden rod and buckwing. That's Great. us. Toronto that's Beavers. a lot of product uh, variations there. It's so. very exciting to engage with, with the clients and the customers here at the fair. Uh, I'm interested in what they're asking us. Yes, I was just going to ask you that. Well, what are they saying here at the show? Well, they're very intrigued by the propolis. They, they, they want to know what, 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 what its origins may be. Uh, definitely, there's more people asking about the apiotherapy therapy products uh, and, and their purpose. Uh, and other people are just looking for a darn good honey. And we've got it here, definitely. The other item is that why, again, they're asking, why is this dark and why is this light? I have explained that for you. And when we move into the prize winning category, which I'll take you to shortly, you'll understand the very great difference in color and product. Great. So for more information right now, your website is w. Take a look. Toronto. TorontoBeekeepers.org. Or if you want to tune in to the Toronto Beekeepers Cooperative, we're at torontobees.ca. And you can always go to Beegirl.com.